Bonjour, friends, and happy French Friday to you. Last week, we decorated my mantle for fall, and this week, we will continue just decorating for fall in my dining room. So please join me, and let's go ahead and get started. Okay, we are going to get started decorating in my dining room. Today, in the corner here, I have a tea cart that we're going to just decorate the top of the table part of it. And I've already just added a black and white buffalo checked pumpkin below, and I'm just keeping the bottom very simple. And then to the top here, I've already added the white table runner. And then on top of that, I put a black and white buffalo checked placemat that I got really cheap on sale uh, last year at uh, Hobby Lobby. And then I purchased the black and white buffalo checked apron this year at Hobby Lobby, 40% uh, off. I thought that would be super cute on my mannequin. And then the teapot is a recent thrift store find for $6.99 and it was missing the lampshade. So I just picked up that brand new lampshade for $3.99 and added it to it. I thought the black and white would go very well with what I have going on here with in my dining room decor. So let's go ahead and get started decorating. Okay, the first thing I'd like to add to my tea cart is a super cute Apples Hay Rice Pumpkins Cormet Cider Bonfire Sweaters. I think this is really cute and it's such a, a nice little stand um, that you can change out seasonally and just take this little card off and add something uh, to change it up for the different seasons and, and holidays. And um, I think I'm just going to go ahead and leave that on there for now because I think that'll be cute. And uh, that was $3 at the Target uh, Dollar Spot or Bullseye Playground, whatever you want to call that. And then I just love that they have the little uh, copper clip here because that's going to tie in very nicely with the other copper accents that I'll have in my dining room as well. Okay, so the next thing I would like to add to the top of my tea cart is this Pumpkin Kisses Harvest Wishes. It's pumpkin maple, seriously good sipping chocolate. So, mmm, sounds so yummy. And I just love the packaging on this as well. And I think it'll look so cute. And the lady that was helping me at Kirkland, she said this is so good. So I'm taking her word for it. And it was $9.99. And then the day that I was in there, they also had 20% off coupons. So make sure you always check to see if your store has coupons. Okay, the next thing I'll be adding is this copper teapot that I thrifted for $2.99. And next we have to have our mugs for our hot chocolate. I've got two of these uh, from Target Dollar Spot for $7. So let's go ahead and add these two. Okay, I will be adding my three tiered tray that I made. Okay, first I'm going to add this cute little chalkboard pumpkin sign that I just got from Kirkland's. It was $5 and then 20% off of that. And I love that I can just change what it says on this cute little sign. So let's go ahead and add that to the top. And then now I'm going to grab my caramel apple. Okay, so next I'll be adding my faux caramel apple, and I have had this for years, so I'm sorry guys, I don't remember where I got it from. I want to say that my mom gave it to me. But like I said, I've had it for years, so um, I can't remember. So we'll go ahead and I think it looks good on the stand so you can see it behind the sign okay. Okay, next we're going to decorate the middle tray. And I just have this little green um, napkin ring that I think I'm gonna set down inside here to add some greenery. And then I have this cute little pumpkin. And I believe I got those in a pack of, and a bag of them at Walmart, uh, super cheap. Okay, I've got some more little pumpkins and leaves, fall leaves and pine cones. We're just gonna play around here and see what happens. <laughs> I'm just gonna start adding. Add 
adding some fall, fall touches here. Okay, so now for the very bottom part of our tray, I'm going to be using these three little pumpkins that are been purchased this year from the dollar spot at Target for a dollar each. And I think they are so cute. So I will be probably using some more fall leaves, uh, maybe a little pine cone and these pumpkins, and then we'll see what I need next. Okay, I feel like I may need a little bit of filler and I will probably use some of these little acorns that I had in my fall stash already and maybe some of these grapevine balls that you can uh, purchase from the Dollar Tree store. Okay, next I believe I'm going to add this little black and white checked pumpkin and my cute little ironstone pitchers to the back of the bottom of this tray here. And I just love little white ironstone pitchers, so I have to add a couple of these. And this one is made in France, and so I absolutely love it, of course. <laughs> All right, so I'm gonna add those three now. Okay, guys, I think I'm changing my mind. I think I want to add this to the top instead of the bottom of my three-tiered tray and so I'm going to do a little rearranging now <laughs> and I'm going to add a white little pumpkin I think where the black and white check one was so okay the next thing I want to add to the top of my tea card are these pumpkin spice cream filled rolled wafers. Mmm, they look so good. Okay, the next thing I want to add is this cute little pumpkin that I've had that uh, I thrifted. And on the other side, it says give thanks. So I can turn it around to that side come Thanksgiving. Okay, the next thing I want to add is this black and white buffalo checked little pumpkin from Target Dollar Spot for $1. Okay, the next thing I want to add is this yummy pumpkin donut candle from Kirkland's. And I love this copper top on here as well. And it's normally $9.99 at Kirkland's, but it was on sale for $8. Okay, last but not least, I want to add a fall tea towel to the tea cart. And this one I purchased from the Dollar Tree store this year. Okay, I'm feeling like my mannequin is looking a little bare up here, up top around her neck here area. So I feel like we need to dress her up a little bit for fall. So, first of all, I would like to add this beautiful maple fall leaf necklace that I made. So I'm gonna add that to her. And then we're also going to add this black and white buffalo checked scarf that I thrifted. And it is dark outside now, so sorry about the lighting. It's not the greatest in here right now uh, without the natural light. From outside so I apologize for that I will try to get some really good shots uh, tomorrow with better lighting before I edit and upload this video
Okay, before I close out this video, I just wanted to share something with you real quick. I received something that was so sweet, just precious, adorable in the mail from my mom. She has been working on getting ready to do a craft show and she's making a lot of fall and Christmas items for the craft show. And we've been FaceTiming each other back and forth um, during this whole process of her being creative and making things right now for the show. And I just happened to get a little sneak peek here of this cute little galvanized bucket with this, these cute little orange pumpkins inside. And she was attaching some of these to something she was making. And it looks so cute. And so I just had mentioned to her that, oh, that would be so cute on my hanging on my fall tree as an ornament. I also just wanted to thank my mom because um, it was such a nice surprise. So thank you, mom. And she is so creative and talented. If she wasn't out of state, I would love to be videoing a step-by-step -step of the different projects she's been working on to get ready for the show. But I at least maybe I can insert some pictures for you guys to see some of the projects that she's been working on. So if you'd like to see that, watch the video all the way to the end and I hope you enjoyed the decorate with me video as well and I will see you in the next one all right until then au revoir